the Bulgarian refugee issue as a hostage of the Serbian-Greek relations between the two world wars. After the Treaty of Bucharest of 1930, Macedonia was divided into three, with the Vardar part falling into the Kingdom of Serbia and the Aegean part joining the Kingdom of Greece. Together with the newly acquired lands, the young countries received a large Bulgarian minorities, recognized by a number of foreign sources. In both countries, the, this population is seen as Slavic speaking, as Slavicized Greece, not ethnic Slavs, or simply as Southern Serbs, but not as Bulgarians. According to the Treaty of Sever, in 1920, Greece opened schools for children from minorities, and in September 1924, the so-called Kauf of Politis Agreement was signed, by which Greece undertook to recognize the Slavs in Macedonia and Thrace as Bulgarians. However, the Greek parliament has rejected ratification of the protocol due to Serbia's objections. The last one unilaterally denounced the secret military pact between the two countries and at the same time worked for the expulsion of Slavs from Greece to its territory. At the end of 1924, 92 families from the Energia Varda region emigrated to Serbia with the promise of receiving large sums of money. And the following year, residents of the villages of Birauci and Lipinci, Eordea region, sent a letter to the League of Nations declaring themselves ethnic Serbs and requiring min minority rights to open schools and churches. Greece has been forced to publish a textbook for children from the Slavic minority, the so-called Abetsidar from 1925, which again, after a reaction from Serbia, was strongly neutralized. With the signing of the newly peace treaty in 1919, Greece imposed on Bulgaria the so-called Convention on Voluntary Eviction between the two countries. After its defeat in the Greek-Turkish War, 1990-1922, it began to settle Greeks from Asia Minor in Macedonia and Thrace and forcibly expelled some of the local Bulgarians there. The Kauf of Politis and Molov Kafandaris agreements only legally shaped this situation. There is no exact data on the numbers of refugees from the respective areas, but in the mid-1920s there are more than 300,000 people from Macedonia alone. By the early 1930s, there were more than 600,000 Macedonian refugees from Serbia and Greece in Bulgaria. They mostly settled in Pirin Macedonia, Sofia, Asenovgrad and the Black Sea coast region. Immigration to Bulgaria continued after that as a result of the denationalization policy in the Kingdom of Greece and the Kingdom of Yugoslavia. After the defeat of the two countries by Nazi Germany in the spring of 1941, during the Second World War and the establishment of the Bulgarian administration in Vardar and the Aegean Macedonia and Western Thrace, there was a reverse process of migration of refugees to their native places. This policy was supported by the Bulgarian authorities as part of the rebulgarization policy of these lands. Until 1944, the Bulgarian population in the Aegean was terrorized by the Greek communist resistance and pro-German paramilitary organizations. After September 9, 1944, a wave of refugees arrived in Bulgaria again with the withdrawing Bulgarian troops.